you just click on create for the begin to begin this tutorial other you can do any directory but I will always do on the D drive because it, for me it's a better and we'll name the VM Oops. Windows NT4 and it's automatically detected at Windows NT4 if not you click on Windows NT4 and then next and uh, I'm gonna bump the RAM up a little bit there we go 256 is good and then create a new hard drive and then, there we go uh, I'm gonna 3 gigs and create there we go and there's another way to load the ISO you just start the machine immediately and it will ask you to load an ISO to install the operating system you'll see it so now the computer is less, making less sounds because this yeah the scan is still in progress with five over five millions five millions file scan it's now scanning the SSD so all right. I said that we will ask you to for an ISO, and if you ha if you have an ISO, you can select one. But you know what? I'm gonna click there because it's not detecting. And you can browse through your folder. Go to the folder where you have your the ISO. Mine is here. NTWKS 40A. So this is in English. This is in French. So I'm gonna select the English. You click open or you double click and then click on start welcome to set up to set up to start to set up press enter press enter again press C you must go down f to accept the agreement. Hit F8 to agree. Keyboard layout fronts. Turkish, Ukrainian, Spanish, Sl Russian, Polish, Latin, Italian, Greek, French. There we go. Uh, okay, okay, okay. The ABL is matches to my computer and hit enter. So we have an, an again the partition part. I'm gonna create a 512 meg for the system and 2.5 gigs for files and etc. So C new unformatted enter and again there is no NTFS quick so we have to do NTFS. You can do also FAT but NTFS is a lot better as I said. So hit enter as you saw it was really quick you can leave it at win and t but I'm gonna, gonna change it to no not Windows Windows my the keyboard is still in English at the setup but I set it to French but it will maybe be set later so now Windows or win and t however you want press enter and then you can do one of those I'm gonna go do enter So now it's asking to insert the ISO. There we go. You just wait a little bit and then you click OK or you press Enter when OK is selected. Okay, so now we are welcome to the setup. You just click next or press enter. You can do one of the those. I'm gonna do I'm gonna do custom. No, no, I'm gonna do typical recommended for most computers. Next. I'm gonna type my name. Okay, so my keyboard is now French, so that's fine. 
next and there's the product key and the computer name I'm gonna enter Windows NT4 we so we are not obligated to the password I'm gonna create one there we go next no do not create an emergency repair desk next show me show me you can do install most common components but um, I will do this because I don't want everything well you know what I'm gonna I'm gonna do no uh, no accessories yes details yes yes yeah I want everything communications I don't want that games yeah I love that I don't want free sale okay multimedia details I'm gonna check everything okay and I, and I, will, I will leave that unchecked so next next uh, you can do this or this but I will do this computer will participate search next 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 continue yes next okay so it takes a while oh computer new windows nt4 next and finish and make sure your time is correct well that's not correct but there we go Paris Madrid Amsterdam January 15 2001 yeah that's correct this date I'm filming the video close okay uh, 16 colors 800 by 600 test okay okay it's fine it's fine yes okay and okay <laughs>
Windows NT is now installed. Thank you so much for watching this video. If it helped you out, please like the video. I hope you liked it. Please subscribe. Bye.